Yes, it's time for a Marvel Contest of Champions video. And even though I'm sounding like a walking, talking didgeridoo, you know, the things that go the oh, 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 oh. that's how I sound like at the moment. It will improve. It'll get worse before it improve. You know, I'm coughing up some green mucusy shit at the moment, but uh, hey, it's still going to be a cracking new year. So let's start as we mean to go on. I really shouldn't be pushing my voice that much, but it doesn't matter. I'm hyped. Because we're going to be opening up some 5 star crystals, but we need to collect the shards first. I need to do 7, and I've got currently 6, but I want to do 7. So, I've been grinding out the weekend on this arena. As you can see, I put in 14.5 million points. Now, the cutoffs are a little bit lower. I will announce those, hopefully, in a Marvel Contest of Champions news. This is a good opportunity to pick up a load of 5 star shards. And as you can see, I only picked up 200 6 star shards. It doesn't matter. 4,000 5 star shards. Nice. And as well, we got a reflective four-star crystal, which is probably going to be naff, but if I get an awakening, there's still five-star shards in my pocket. And as you can see, I'm 1,200 away from having that seventh to open today. I'm going to kick things off by opening up this four-star reflective crystal. Like I said, five-star shards is all I need. We've got some greater gifting crystals to open, and I did say, and did sort of a smile, that, you know, I was going to... I know it's like kick, kicked off with a domino, so I'll, I'll set for that. It's pretty darn decent. Would it be nice to get a dark hawk? But still, uh, having a Domino at 4 star, pretty nice. I've got the 5 star version, and it's an absolute delight. And Kabam, pushing off this uh, Grandmaster's upgrade. It's like a top up. Oh, yeah, so yeah, I really want that, don't I? No, we've got some great gifting crystals to open, and I'm hoping that I can get some 5 star shards from this, which basically means I don't have to spend out quite so much. I was hoping to get an Awakening then, that would help out that. But if we get something good from the great gifting crystals, then hey, win win. Now, from this, as we know, just need to get anything like 2,000 five-star shards would be great because that means that I don't have to uh, spend out quite so much on my four stars because I was going to hope to wait to do an opening with Frank the Tortoise. He'll be coming out of hibernation soon, so I'm quite excited by that. So I'm going to get the gold, and then the bonus item is... Oh, well, that's not exactly what I was hoping for, but hey, this last one could be... Oh man, if it was a Thanos, that would be absolutely fantastic for this video, but this is all about opening up five stars primarily, but we've got to get to the seventh one. So here we go. First of all, it's the ISO, then it's going to be the gold, and then hopefully something fantastic for the last one. Five star shards? Four star shards? What's going on here? Okay, just doing some quick math. It does mean that I need to open up five awakenings on here. So, okay, hopefully, fingers crossed, five awakenings, which they are. So that's that's good. This saved, whew, this saved this video because I was worried then. That I was like, okay, so I've already gone, yay, so we're going to open up seven today. And then I'm going to have to note it down to a fail because I couldn't make the cut for the opening seven. I've made the cut. We can now open the seven. Thank God. One thing I've got to make sure is don't ruin my vocal cords if I get something good and scream. As uh, it's still New Year's Eve and I need to go out for a, a thing, which hopefully I'm well enough and not coughing up any green, you know, shit for. So if I scream, then ah, it's not going to, oh, that's going to be the scream. Ah, yeah, great reactions. But there's so many things that I want. There's so many things that are out at the moment. You know, uh, awakening up the two champions that have recently got Domino and Wolverine, not Wolverine, uh, Iron Man Infinity War. Kovas Glaive. I've got that Cosmic Awakening gem. And, you know, I was thinking about using it on him. But then if I get Hyperion, I'm probably going to use it on him. Ah, oh, so many things to think about. Extra signatures onto Spider-Man. Uh, Spider-Man. Star oh, Stark and Hat Spidey. Oh, my love affair with that champion. Uh, as well, uh, Proxima Midnight would be great. I think it was one champion that went earlier. I mean, Doctor Voodoo would be great as well. But I, I'm still kind of like quite excited for uh, for Scarlet Witch potentially entering in. First crystal of seven is gonna be. Oh, right. okay. Well, I was hoping for this champion um, uh, to use in contest of memes for 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 a meme that i was uh, had an idea for but um yeah i recently got the four star version so wasn't overly hunting that champion uh, and one of the big reasons that i'm choosing basics at the moment is because i'm going to be doing more arena grinding in order to get more units through the purpose of uncollected arena crystals so i'm happy for new champions that's my positive side of things increases the amount of points i can get uh, will I be taking him any further than 345? The answer is a resounding new. No, I won't be. Uh, Bishop Awakened, that'd be great. Korg? Yeah, definitely Korg. That's another champion. 
so many people have so many frustrations with, against that champion for defense and i want a slice of that pie i think we all want a slice of that pie it's not just about me it's about you guys as well you want the go-to champions the champions that have been notable for defense amazingness and great offensive champions as well as we slow down the spin and we get it okay approximate midnight i'm happy about this that Cosmic Awakening gem may be looking quite favorable on that champion. And that's two new champions. Uh, as I said, that is something that I'm looking forward to for 2019 is getting new champions, new champions to the roster. And having two starters, uh, two new champions, is great. And if I can get some more substantial ones, some of these go-to offensive champions, then happy days. Unfortunately, my, I, think, I feel like I'm a shortness of breath now. Man, I, I just hit the gym for the first time in four months after this whole kind of thing with like work breaking down and like focusing a bit more on YouTube and picking up more of a stronger part-time job. Then getting ill when I was so hyped was just not exactly the best thing in the world. But we smile and we move on, keep calm and carry on. You know, uh, lots of positive, positive thinking there. Positive mental attitude for 2019. I think a lot of people uh, are having that. So yeah, come on, bring on 2019. And it's gonna be, uh, okay, that was weird. Um, and then dropped on a green goblin. I thought I was getting a Loki uh, awakening, but still, like I said, is this really odd? There are three new champions, there's four more to open. Uh, and I'm still like, hmm, four, yeah, that's, uh, that's cool. Um, three new champions. Is it going to be seven new champions in total? It would be nice to get one awakening, or maybe on a, a champion that I've said, Domino. Um, maybe a champion that I've got a an awakening gem for. So I've got a cosmic awakening gem. But as we know, if you follow the channel, I've only I've only not got cosmic champions at five star. There's only three that I have, and for a time, I think it was a good year, I only had the one in shape and form of uh, Captain Marvel until i pulled medusa and awakened her and now recently i've got uh now two i've got two cosmic awakening gems and i probably will use it on angela because hey i've got two cosmic awakening gems and no well no i i, I, I tell a lie i just got proxima so uh hey shut your mouth rich i will next one up is gonna be oh so, so far that was gonna go one more um to, to Domino and be that Domino Awakening that I was uh, hoping for. But it's okay. It's still a new champion. Not overly happy about that. But still, I'm happy to be picking up Proxima. Uh, that's definitely one to be happy about. There's so many, like Archangel, I'd love to get. Ghost, obviously love to get that champion. There's so many that uh, I still eluded my clutches for just getting the stand. I mean, Star-Lord, like how long has it been? And I've not got Star-Lord. This is something that I thought I would uh, I would at least get, but the four star one escaped me for years. Okay, I've had enough of the spin and it's time to win. Another new champion. Have I got this one? Oh God. I'm not, I'm not, the thing is right, I'm getting what I want, which is that uh, champions um, not awakened. Five new champions. So five crystals, five new champions. Um, hey, I can't grumble at that. Uh, look at that. It's mainly tech orientated, not the best tech. But I do have a bit of a love affair with Nebula. So I am happy to get Nebula um, into the roster. And with two more to go, what could this be? Could this be another two new champions? This is going to be great for arena grinding. I know some people will say, no, they won't be good for arena grinding. But it's all about points accumulating and recently doing the arena as we just said having points is really good and having loads of kind of new five stars is going to mean that's going to be helpful to me grinding out the arena as uh, i did find that i really could have done with uh, at least about five to seven more five stars new five stars to grind out arena with and when you get to that point you're like uh, in, in the game where you want more five stars for this purpose then man, you you nodally know it, Neddy. Okay, uh, what am I getting from this one? It is gonna be... <sighs> no, I don't think I have this one. Oh my God, this is gonna be, this is like new champion central, isn't it? This is, I'm getting what I want, I'm getting my wish. 
of new champions. Unfortunately, it's not exactly what I, I was imagining from this opening. I didn't know whether or not it's going to be one of my newfound epic openings. Um, but it serves a purpose, as I've said. It serves the purpose of me being able to grind out arena a lot more by having a lot more five-star champions. I'll just wait for a level up event and uh, level all those ones up a little bit more. Some I will take further, a lot further. Um, probably Nebula, I'll take a lot further. I'll pro or Proxima, obviously, without Shadow, without Proxima is gonna be um, utilized a lot more. Especially because I'll probably awaken her, but I don't really have the signature stones. So we will we'll see, we'll see with that. But I'm definitely not gonna awaken, I definitely wasn't gonna awaken prior to opening up this crystal. So come on, the last one, can it be something good? Can it be an awakening that I want? And the answer is a resounding, no, no it's not. Uh, so that's crap. But the fact is I got what I wanted, which was I got a load of new five star champions. I've never seen that before. Opening seven five star basics and getting seven new champions. I haven't seen that at all um, or you know, if you're new to the game, you probably will. The piece of resistance from this is Proxima Midnight. That's one positive. And also for me, Nebula, because I do really enjoy this champion. Uh, hitting in all those kind of shock damage and, and, and other stuff. Granted, it'd probably be best that I have her awakened um, to have that rege regeneration hitting off. But either way, I'm happy with the opening for the sole purpose of being able to grind out more points in arena and you have to take positives from what you may consider to be negatives i've got all the offensive champions i need it would be great to get better defensive champions but at the same time it's all about arena grind thank you very much for watching this video happy new year smash it in 2019 and we'll do some fantastic videos and more live streams when i get my voice back i will be doing a lot more live streams um, but you know straining to talk and all that so Happy New Year and uh, like, share and subscribe and I shall catch you in the next one. Bye bye for now.